what's up guys it's talha here and in this video i'm going to show you how to convert an imperial drawing into metric in autocad so the reason why i'm making this video is that you guys know i share the reference cad drawings i use in my videos on my website but people who work in metric units cannot use those files so by using this method you can convert my drawings into metric and follow my tutorials so let's get started so as you can see here i have already opened the autocad now let's open up a drawing so let's go to open files and here i have some drawings which i used in my recent tutorial series so i will select this one's ground floor and open and now here first let's check this drawing units so you need to just click here and then drawing utilities and select units and you can see the drawing is in imperial so the scale unit scale unit to scale is set to inches so let's close this now before converting this drawing we need to check the we need to check the size of any of these elements maybe you can you can select you can check the thickness of the walls or the width of the windows so i will check the thickness of this wall here so select the, this dimension and let's check this so it's 8 inches so now let's open up the autocad units converter then we will convert these inches into a metric maybe millimeters or centimeters so to open the calculator you just need to you just need to type quick cal c it's the command enter and then it will open up this calculator here and now here you need to look for the unit conversion just click here and then scroll down and you can see the unit types it's yes we want in length so convert from unit to select inches it's already selected so we'll select again inches and then convert to let's select millimeters you can see we want to convert these inches into millimeters so i will select millimeters and then let's give the value to convert so it's eight inches enter and it's 203 so we will take it as 200 so 200 mm will be the thickness of this wall so let's close this and now i will just press un to open up the drawing units dialog and here in the length length type you need to select decimal and then the precision i will just make it zero and the unit to scale let's select you can select either centimeters or meters if you want but for now i will select millimeters and now click ok now you can see here the dimension units are still in inches so you need to edit that so just press d enter to open the dimension style manager and here go to modify and then primary units and here also you need to change the units format to decimal and precision i will just make it zero and click ok ok let's change the height of the text maybe maybe 80 mm and the arrow may be 50 okay set current close and you can see the thickness of this is only 8 8 millimeters it did not change anything so you can see the door size is only 36 so let's scale this drawing so to do that you just need to select all select all this drawing and then we will scale this so the scale command is sc enter and you can see it's asking you to specify the base point so let's select this one as the base base point and then it will give you two more options so you need to select the reference here and then it will ask you to select the reference length I will select these two lines because we want to give the reference of these two walls so select this point and then this line and now 
it will ask you to give the length so if you remember the, the thickness of this wall was 200 millimeters so you need to give that here 200 enter and now the drawing is now on on a perfect scale so let's check that let's check the wall size here it's 200 millimeters and the door is 900 everything is now perfect so that's how you can convert the drawing units in AutoCAD so I'm not sure this is the only only way to do that I just figured this out myself so and I thought it would be helpful to you guys also so that's it for this tutorial I hope you have learned something new so please make sure to like and share this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and see you guys in the next video